Hi, this is Tanya from Love Buddha Tarot, back with the monthly reading for Gemini for March 2018. How are you doing, Gemini? Um, just before I start your reading, I just want to say, if anybody would like a personal reading with me, I'm not going to be available all of March. I do have to go back to the UK. I'm packing everything up and I'm moving over here um, permanently or as permanent as anything is, okay? So uh, that is going to restrict my time for readings. So if anybody would like a personal reading please click the link below uh, you can go through to my book and form and you can get booked in before I actually start on my upheaval or travels or whatever but I'm, I'm not worried about it. I feel like I'm the luckiest girl in the world to be honest you know it's um it's everything is just working out wonderfully so, uh, like I say, if you do want to read, it better sooner rather than later. And this reading is for Gemini Moon, Gemini Sun and Gemini Rising. People keep asking, is it for all of them? And yes, it is. The intent is for Gemini. So whichever you resonate with, then, you know, this is for you. So please check your Moon and uh, Rising as well. Okay. So, right, Gemini, I'm going to go with what I'm picking up psychically for you first. Okay. And it's almost like I feel that you could be... A bit of your own worst enemy okay this month this is the warning that is coming in we know Gemini is the twins and Gemini has two sides and I really feel this is what really needs to be addressed this month okay it's almost like you're wanting something you you need connection but it's almost like you're not trusting people so you're not going with this connection if that makes sense okay so what they're saying is it's almost like you need to get put yourself in the position of another person take you out of it okay take this sort of split this way where you're split you know out of it and because this is going to free you okay i think your thinking at the minute is giving you restrictions and you're thinking you're thinking you're hard done to or you're thinking somebody isn't trustworthy or you're thinking that you know somebody is out to get you or you know they're wanting something off you this is this could actually sort of stop you from moving forward it could stop you from forming a really strong connection which will benefit you greatly okay so like i say you know do not think that everything it's almost like you're thinking all the glitters is not gold where sometimes you know gold does glitter <laughs> gemini so please don't let this this put you off in any way because when i'm looking at your cards here as well what i'm getting here is it's almost like i feel like I feel like you are torn, okay? You're torn between your emotions and you're torn between your head. So it's almost like you're trying to turn off your emotions, okay? Because I feel that there's a lot of them there. There is something going on at the moment and there is a lot of them there. Something may have, something may have sparked your passions or passion or something like that okay you might be wanting to this like wild abandon you might be wanting to go off and do something that you've never done before but then your head is saying no stay safe stay well with what you know stay with what you know gemini and that is not where you are going to get rewards okay so i feel you need to be more flexible whatever it is you're feeling allow it okay sit with your feels they might be a bit uncomfortable at first but sit with them because they have something very, very important to tell you, okay? Your feelings are your ally. Your head is kind of, you know, you get into your ego. Your ego is your false friend, okay? So this is what I really feel you need to be careful of this, this month. It's almost like, you're a little bit in limbo, okay? You're swinging from one side to the other and, you know, you don't know what to do. Just check in your heart, okay? That will guide you and tell you the way here. Um, I do feel there's a little bit of, um, I want to say like a, like a little toddler tantrum some of you may be having this month as well, Gemini, okay? It's almost like, oh, why does this always happen to me? You know, and it's like, you know, wh why not? You know, why not? You may have had shit in the past, but we all have, you know, it is a part of life but learn from it and don't let that restrict you from going forward because it's almost like you're not happy where you are and you're not happy in this stuckness gemini okay so they're telling you you know just go out there explore this is what you need to do if you are having feelings for someone or around a situation go out and explore them see where they're going you know because i feel that there's a lot of security around this and i do feel that this could possibly be um god i'm getting such a pain in my head you know it's it's almost like you're doing your own head in here gemini um 
I feel this could be around relationships, okay? And this could be connected with an earth sign as well. It's almost like an earth sign is is offering you security or offering you something and you are you're thinking what's the catch this is what i this is what i feel what's the catch you know that i don't feel there is no i don't feel there is a catch sorry i'm my grammar is is terrible the way they're they're bringing the messages through there there is no catch okay there is no catch they've just showed me a door with no catch on neither so you are not restricted okay you can actually um you can actually go where you want to go. This, this this is what I feel. But it's like I say, follow your heart, not your head here. Because there's a lot of energy coming through for you um, this month, uh, Gemini. And I feel some of you, this could be connected as well with a job. Because it's almost like there's a new job offer coming for you out of the blue. And this could be something you've dreamed of. But then you sit and you think, oh, well, I'm safe where I am. I have a pension. I have this. I have that. Go out and explore. Go out and try it, you know. Regret something you have done rather than something that you hadn't, haven't. But I don't think you will regret this because what I feel is you just being a lot more balanced. It's almost like when you allow your heart to take control, that will allow you to then feel in a much better place as well. Because it's almost like you've been you've been trapped. It's like you've been locked away, you know, or, or something like that. And now they're saying, that this is it, you're being given keys. I don't know if that makes any sense, but some of you are being key, keys. This might be metaphorical, or it might, it's almost like a key to a door or a key to open the door or something. This is what I'm feeling is coming in this month for you. And I feel that this is, you're going to be, it's like you're going to step into abundance, okay? Step into a life that you wanted to live, but thought that you couldn't. It's like your wishes have been heard. No more illusions. This is it. You know, it's, it's almost like I want to just say to you, trust, okay? Yes, we've all had our trust betrayed in the past, you know, but can you really carry that with you for the rest of your life and constantly be looking over your shoulder and mistrusting people? You know, that is not serving you well, Gemini, okay? And it's almost like you're weighing up the pros and cons a hundred times. This is it. It's how how long do you, does it take you to think about something? You know, if it feels right, do it because there is there is a fantastic offering for you here okay and you cannot let your future be governed by your past okay be scared allow yourself to feel the fear but do it anyway when we feel fear it means we're about to do something brave okay so like i say fear and excitement actually have the fa the same physical uh, symptoms. Uh, so I don't know if symptoms is the word. They have the same physical symptoms. It's only our brain that tells us which one is which. So instead of being scared with this, get excited because this is something new, you know, and something new is not to be feared. It's to be explored and sort of dived into, you know, I love this. I really, really like this card. Massive trust issues coming in with you this month. Gemini that you really need to keep under control because I feel this is it's almost like you're given you're given your ego your power and you're letting that take control and your soul is sitting there going well what am I doing you know why why am I even bothering um because your soul just wants you to be happy your ego wants you to be in this safe confined and that that isn't going to work for you okay so it's about turning your back on something that you've known being sort of excited being exhilarated and you know like seeing this as like it, it's almost like it's a little adventure you know it's the changes are coming whether you want them or not Gemini so it's almost like you know stop resisting because you're putting energy there where it's it's not needed you know you're, you're it's almost like you're swimming against the tide but the tide is going to take you where it wants to be and this is the universe it is guiding you to where you should be okay but you're that worried about what might happen you know it's like oh what if i fail you know but what if you don't this is it it's like jumping off the cliff was it in peter pan but what if i fall he said yeah but what if you fly and this is what i'm seeing for you this month gemini okay this month is going to be the start if you take a risk this month this is going to have a knock-on effect for the next six months and you will be thanking me in the six month i can guarantee that because this is actually looking wonderful for you so please put your defenses down okay there is a new life ahead of you um very creative very creative feel coming through with this as well it's like 
it's like there's there's love, there's passion, there's colour, there's you know it's it's. I've only done two readings on the on this month, and they're they're both absolutely amazing ones. You know, there is success at the end of your comfort zone. You're not going to get success where you're in it. Okay, so put the baggage down. Travel light. This is what I'm saying. You're carrying so much baggage from the past at the moment, Gemini, and they're saying dump it on the roadside. You know, and sort of, you know, get on that. Get on that. You know, the path of life. It's hard for you to keep fighting all the time. So stop it. Stop fighting because you know it's looking at the past is not going to give you answers. Okay. The future is looking good, you're looking solid, you're looking secure and you're wearing yourself out with all of this worry. The universe is giving you an offer this month, please take it, don't block it, okay? Because all you're doing is blocking yourself with this Gemini, okay? I'm, I'm seeing like it's almost like, yes, you've had the rain, but you know, now you're being presented with the rainbow and you know, please go out and enjoy it you know rainbows are beautiful beautiful things and i think this is the start of abundance it's the start of something beautiful okay for you gemini so i hope that makes sense to you i'm going to pull a spirit card and see what spirits have to say for you um yeah get out of your own way gemini that is what is is needed this this month i feel okay spirit card for gemini please Right, okay, quite an interesting card this. And this is, your vibration is being raised to a higher level. You may be feeling that somehow you are in this world, but somehow not of this world. So I really feel psychically you're, you're, you're picking stuff up. <coughs> this is the magic of creation at work in your life. A silver starlight enters your aura, your energy field is strengthened, giving you a clearer connection to spirit and revealing the greater purpose of your life. So that's it this month, you know, there is big things happening, there are big things happening for you, it's like I say, sorry about my grammar, um, there are big things happening for you this month, Gemini, okay, but if you, you're standing in the way, you could stand in the way of these big things, so it's like, get out of it, you know, allow, go with the flow rather than fighting against it. So I hope that makes sense. Please let me know if it does. Um, and like I say, if anybody does want a personal reading with me, please get in touch via the link below. Um, it's very easy. It just clicks. Please bear in mind that, you know, the time zones, your time zone will be on there. But the time that you book is on a 24 hour clock as well. OK, so have an absolutely fabulous month, Gemini. It's It could be this could be an amazing month for you if you allow it. OK, so it's almost like, um, yeah, they're giving me the words there. Let it be. So I, I don't know what that means. OK, but that's the, the song that they're playing to me at the moment. Let it be. So, yeah let it be and then you will be free i think <laughs> okay so have an absolutely fabulous month i'm sending lots of love gemini satnam